This is round two of the Scarlet Sorcerer. I have a theory. I am I'm currently looking for power crystals, a, a power crystal that will uh, that will lead to the demise of the local Death Lord. I have reason to believe that I am in Grey Marsh. A- am, am I definitely there? I have no idea. Right now, I, I feel like I need to look for a landmark, and in my current position, I can see some, sort of maybe some ruins or something off there at X76, or maybe and some some marshes, marshland. It looks like. And possibly the tail end of the river Chole, maybe uh, down at 86. Over on 13, um, those are mountains. I'm avoiding mountains from now on. That's just a policy that I've had. I, I, I've been mountains eat days, and I only have 25 more days to get that power crystal before the Death Lord, um, I guess, takes over. So, or, or rather, I think it's 25 days until I assume that the emerald enchanter has found the power crystal or something like that it's it's a it's a, a weird lose condition but anyway uh 76 let's let's check that out so going back here at 76 this place of worship has been derelict for hundreds of years there are no clues to be found and you lose one day darn that was not what i wanted okay 86 let's see if there's anything down here in the marshes i i don't think there will be but let's find out gray marsh is a dangerous place to land a skyship your craft becomes trapped on the mud, and it takes you a week to free it. Oh my goodness, what a horrible, horrible place. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, this is bad. Days are very, very precious, as I've said before. Those are the, that's the, the resource that I, that I cannot renew in any way. So to lose that, it's not great. Um, and I, I guess I do know now that those were the marshes, so at least I got confirmation of where I am. So I kind of feel like I need to go northeast to get to Xersis. That's page 186. So I'll flip back to 186, which of course uses another day. And I don't know, looking at this, I'm thinking, yep, this is probably Xersis. Big old city, smack dab in the middle of the map, or my viewport, whatever. X100 to find out more. Let's take a look. You arrive at the city of Xersis and discover it was here that Silvarian was born. You find his brother still alive, and he pledges his help in return for one special item. If you possess a special item and wish to give it to him, turn to 121. I don't have a special item. I cannot receive his help. I was really kind of hoping he would have a special item for me. Okay, so that was a a dead end, which is really painful to find out. However, there's another place that we've been led to, and that was Daggerwood. I prayed at a shrine or a temple and had a vision of oak, uh, of a dagger and some oak. Oak is wood, a dagger is a dagger. I'm thinking Daggerwood. So, northeast, once again. So that's page 29. Of course, it takes me a day to get to page 29, so I will mark off one more day. So now I only have 15 days left. It looks like there's a forest and maybe a town at 61. So I think I'll stop at the town first. Although I, you know what? No, maybe I'll stop at the forest first. You discover a ranger's hut in the middle of the forest. The woodsman who lives there says he knows someone in the city of Torsh who can help you in your quest. If you wish to go with the woodsman to Torsh, lose a day and go to 122. I kind of feel like that might be worth it. So I'll take a day and I'll go to 122. You've been tricked. The man who takes you to the man takes you to your rival, the Emerald Enchanter, who imprisons you in a magical sphere. He is now free to search for the Death Lord's power crystal while you contemplate your fate in solitary confinement. Sadly, your quest ends here. Okay, so I'm going to put down one failure and I'm going to um mark that I'm gonna take that day back and pretend like we didn't do that. So that was one fail before success. <laughs> um, I, I figure there's no point in stopping this storyline yet, so I'm just going to keep playing. But that is, I, I've marked it down as a as as a failure. All right, so 61. Let's pretend like we didn't go to the forest, and instead we went to the city. On the outskirts of the village of Stoneplow, you meet an old tinker pushing a handcart full of wares. He offers you a trinket, yes, on a gold chain shaped in the likeness of a wishbone. If you choose to accept this lucky talisman, accept it or uh, mark it down on your solo sheet as a special item. Okay, so I'll put down golden, I guess wishbone, wishbone, 
And that's really good. That's kind of what I wanted. So now, I mean, according to my current strategy, which I can't believe is the correct one, I need to go back to the Dragon Mist Marshes and place this trinket on the altar so that I can get my wish fulfilled. Okay, so I'm on 29 right now. Um, I think I came from 186, so I'll mark a day off and go back to 186 just to kind of confirm visually that that's the correct path. Yes, because that was Xersis. Got it. Okay. And then I believe from there I had come from this, uh, this uh, from here, the southwest. Uh, uh, so that's 205. So I'll mark another day off and go to 205. Yeah, yeah. These are the gray marshes or whatever they're called. Yep. I remember this. And then from here, I believe I was just, I had just traveled uh, from, 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 from the west. So that's 67. So I'll mark another day off and go to 67. Kind of feel like I'm just flying by these places now that I don't have to investigate them. Travel feels a lot faster. Oh, those are the mountains to avoid. Absolutely avoid those. But uh, I'll just keep going, keep going westward. Mark a day. Westward is 75. Okay, here we are in 75. Yeah, so I'm really, really close now. Um, I think west one more time. So that's one more day. Ooh, it's been five days. So I've only got 10 more days. If this does not work, then, well, then I've failed, I believe. And I'll probably just have to start start over. Um, okay, so that's um, oh, 126 south, south 126. So mark another day off nine days left but but here i am i'm in the i'm in the dragon marshes uh and just just below corn the city of corn there okay so the 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 dragon marsh was 32 i'm gonna go to x32 i'll just read that really quickly again on a rocky slope rising out of the dragon mist marshes stands the altar of the silver dragon the legend says that if you place a treasure upon the altar you'll have a wish granted. If you wish to place a special item on the altar, uh, turn to 113. It just occurred to me that this could be a horrible curse. <laughs> like, just because it says that people get wishes granted doesn't mean people get wishes granted. This could be a horrible, horrible thing to do, and I've banked everything on it. Okay, so 113 it is. Let's find out what my fate is. The object fades and disappears. So I've, I've placed the golden wishbone trinket onto the altar. The object fades and disappears from the altar. Your vo you, you voice your wish, asking for the locations of the Death Lord's crystals to be made known to you. Actually, I would have preferred it if he just delivered me the death crystal. But anyway, three images form upon the altar. A dagger, a tree, and a cloaked man with a sun-like symbol emblazoned upon his chest. To continue your quest, turn back to 126. Oh boy, that doesn't do me as much good as I had hoped. So that that's um okay. So I've got once again, I think I've got dagger, dagger wood, and then a sun icon, and I have no idea what that's referring to. So it's gonna take me several days. So I think six days to get back to dagger wood, and and even then I don't know where. From from there, I don't know where I'm I'm meant to go or or who I'm meant to find. It's someone someone with a with a sun logo on their chest, but I don't know how to find that person. But I mean, there's no other choice. I mean, from here, like I I was hoping that uh, I was really hoping for something a lot more profound from that wish. Okay, so backtracking again, retreading my steps. Uh, I'm going to go... Actually, you know what? I don't have to do the exact same path, I don't think. I'd better. That's the way I know. But you know what? It would be more fun not to. So instead, I think I'm going to go to 165. Okay, so 165, There's looks like there's a little town there, but I'm not going to fall for that. I'm not going to stop. I'm going to just keep going to page 43. Lose another day... 43. Boy, this looks tempting. I really want to stop and look at what's in that tower. But nobody's talked about a tower. It's just this one tower. A power crystal could definitely be in that tower, but I don't know why it would be. So, yeah, maybe that's silly. Okay, all right, I'll just keep going. I'm going to keep going east to 156. Okay, 156, another town. I'm not going to get distracted by that as well. And instead, I shall go to, I think, 36... I'm not really recognizing anything yet. I mean, I don't know why I would. I've never been this far south e east, but 
Ah, here we go. Now this is very highly recognizable. Uh, that's the Fearland Bay. So that must be, what is it, Be Belazar? Uh, is the town, I think, on the, on the, yeah, Belazar of Fearland Bay. That's easy to recognize. And so according to this map, I need to just go north, really. Yeah, I'll go north to three. Uh, lose a day. I might have, I might, I might be off on my days now, but that's okay. I'm, might have skipped a day or something. Uh, three. This doesn't look, I'm trying to place this on the map. I don't know where this would be, and that's fine. Um, I'll just kind of keep going. Uh, I'll keep going north to 186, I guess. Yeah, 186. If I get, if I get to this, to, to, if I find the, the right person, oh, hold on, a day. If I get someone and they tell me to go back to 43 and look in that tower, I'm going to be really, really angry. Ah, here, this, I, I recognize this. This is, of course, Xersus, the city of Xersus. Uh, so from Xersus, I think I just went northeast, if I recall correctly. 229. Yeah. Yep. I recognize this place. So this, this, the, the one X1, that forest, that's where I met the woodsman who tricked me and, and ended up making me lose the game. Uh, and then in 61, it was like a city. So I wonder if I'm, is this not Daggerwood yet? Or was that Daggerwood? All right. I'm going to, I'm going to take a peek at 61. I guess, I guess I should have taken, no, that was stone plow. And that's where I got that lucky lucky talisman. Okay, so that's... I'm thinking maybe continue northeast. That's what I'm kind of thinking, to 113. Um, yeah, maybe I haven't gotten to Daggerwood yet. Maybe that was my problem all along. 113. Lose a day. Now, hopefully I'm going to see... No, not really. Boy, I do not know where I am. I'm lost. Uh, let's look. Looking for Daggerwood. No, I feel like I've gone too far, too far east now. I guess I could go west a bit, but I should probably try to find my bearings, even though it's probably going to end in disaster. I only have two more days left, so let's go to X-72. In the grand city of Elephon, you hear that Silvarian is rumored to have been murdered in the city of Vardor, and lose one day. Vardor? Where was Vardor? I thought that was all the way back east. Vardor. No, okay, it's north. North of Daggerwood, even. Okay. Well, I, I don't know. Uh, I, th I guess I'll go to four. Um, I mean, I could go to Vardor, but that would be the 40th day, and then I would lose. Um, I have a feeling I'm going to lose at four now, but um, I, I don't think that the crystal's going to be in Vardor. I could be wrong. Okay, the citizens of this fishing village harbor a deep hatred of all estal... Est Stalonians. They attack you as they hear your voice. As soon as they hear your voice, lose three endurance. Endurance I got. I don't care about endurance. Okay, so I'm down to like, what, 19 now or something? I guess I'll go northwest to Vardor. Uh, and that's my 40th day, I think, give or take, to 38. But I might as well investigate while I'm here. Um, I, th I think I'm sort of allowed to do that. I mean... So this is 238. Oof, this doesn't look like Vardor to me. It must be, though, because I can't go any further north. Let's look at the map again. Maybe not. Yeah, um, I could be... Well, let's find out. So, X33 and X42. So, let's go to 42 first, because I like those temples. Those have been interesting. I don't know if this is a temple. Looks kind of like a tomb. Power Crystal could be in a tomb. Um... 42. Oh, it's a stronghold. Do you remember um, the the poem? The poem we got was to find a knight in a stronghold who would help us on our quest. I wonder if this is going to be something good. So the guardian of the stronghold demands a special item before allowing you to enter if you wish to give him. Well, I don't have that. So, oh, it's a dead end. Such a frustrating dead end. And and the game is technically over. But I'm, you know, I've got until midnight, right, of this day. So I'm going to go to 33 and just really hope that something is here. Uh, the ruins of this ancient castle have long since been deserted. No clues. Lose a day. So I'm, I'm very much, yeah, I, I spend way too much time looking around this region. I don't find anything. And, and... By the time I'm, I look up from all my work, uh, I have, I have failed in my quest. What, what exactly happens if I fail 
anything. You have 40 days in which to find the power crystal. If after 40 days have elapsed, and they have, you still and you have still not found it, then it will be assumed, then it is assumed, that it has been discovered by servants of the Death Lord or by your rival, the Emerald Enchanter. In this event, you lose the game. So that was um, that was two fails here, and um, a lot of fun. I'm going to play it again until I win. So I will be playing this a third time, and we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching.